Hi everyone, my name is Ashanti and welcome to Uniquely Ashanti's Corner. Today I'm bringing to you another dose of vitamin P and today's subject is do not live off of compliments. Now, let me ask you guys a question and this is not anything for you to answer. You don't have to. Um, this is just something for you to think about, okay? How many of you guys enjoy getting compliments? Everyone, right? <laughs> it's always... A nice feeling when someone compliments us on our accomplishments, um, our appearance, a portrait that we bought, and the list just goes on and on and on from there. However, there are some people out there who actually live off of compliments. They feel like that if they're not getting compliments on a regular basis, it means that they don't look right, um, they didn't put forth their best effort, uh, they don't have good taste, and so on. And some people will go as far as to uh, force someone to give a compliment by saying something like, isn't this nice? Or don't I look good? People like this always need verification that they're doing things right. Otherwise, they start feeling bad about themselves. While um, it's nice to get compliments from people from time to time, their opinions really don't matter. At the end of the day, your opinion is all that matters. Even if a lot of people are telling you that they don't like what you have, how you style your hair, um, the way you decorated your house or whatever it is, it doesn't matter. Not everyone uh, has the same taste, which makes us all unique. And there is absolutely positively nothing wrong with that. And just because people are not complimenting you doesn't always mean that you are doing something wrong. I personally don't get compliments every day and it doesn't bother me, okay? I remember when uh, there were days that I really dressed girly, you know, um, had my hair down, a flowy blouse, sandals, earrings. I would be looking real nice if I do say so myself. <laughs> Not to make it seem like I'm just full of myself, which I am not. I never think that I am better than anyone. That is not in my heart. That's not the type of person I am. I never have that type of mentality. I'm just confident in my appearance. Anyway, moving on. <laughs> I remember when I would go out to events uh, or to school or wherever I had to go. And I had this one relative who will always ask me if someone gave me compliments and if so, what did they say? This is something that really irritated me a lot because I wasn't dressing up for others. I was always dressing up for only three people, me, myself, and I. Those are the three people that I was focused on, me, myself, and I. <laughs> I'm not trying to get someone's attention by dressing a certain way. Sometimes I got compliments and sometimes I didn't. It's not like I went home crying, tears running down my face just because someone said, um, well, not say, but someone didn't say, oh, you look so pretty today. <laughs> There is no sense in getting upset over little things right like that. It's just, it's not even worth it. Life goes on. I already knew that I looked fine. I didn't need anyone to confirm it. If you program yourself to live solely off of compliments, you know what? You'll eventually drive yourself insane waiting for someone to say something nice to you. You don't want to get your nerves all tense up over something like that. It's really a waste of time. Find comfort in knowing that God sees you as a beautiful person or handsome person. I know that there are guys out there that do not like to be called beautiful. That's why I corrected myself. <laughs> and remember to embrace the things you like despite what others might say. 
And that concludes this dose of vitamin P. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I hope that this was a message that touched somebody out there who needed to hear it. Uh, feel free to share this message with whoever you feel like needs to hear it. Leave your thoughts down below. I would love to hear from you. I always welcome that. But if you do leave a comment, please refrain from profane language, even if it's an abbreviation. And please be respectful. God bless you guys. And I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye. Oh my gosh, I thought that I finished. Okay, this is bye for real. Bye. <laughs>